All right, y'all, so I know I'm like maybe like a week and a half late of Hogwarts Legacies being live, but I went and did the entire stream live on Twitch and YouTube. It was a combination of both, but I believe I did the launch on Twitch. I, I think it was YouTube. I could be wrong. So I will be uploading the entire playthrough um, of the gameplay. I know I'm a little bit late, but the game is essentially done. I will probably end up having 30 to 45 minutes per episode. This will be a long, long series for you guys. Let me know if you guys want just only um side missions included with the main missions or just strictly main missions just let me know i love you guys i will also have the last of us i will try to work on some other games in the process that i have not finished those will be live on twitch but also be brought over to youtube for you guys so that way i can grow on twitch whatever i can do with twitch and bring them over here enjoy the series man okay. all right continue i don't see nothing i can change this give me performance And your rewards. I'll do that later. They're doing all this shit. Let me play the game, bro. Like, let's play the game, man. Alright. Is it a preset? Well, I can... Let's make our own, boy. Let's make our own character, man. See what we got. Put the face. Oh, first, let me change the skin color first. I want to be dark as hell. There we go. I want to be a werewolf in this bitch. You got a big ass nose? I'm telling you, dog. That's what I want to see. I want to see a big ass nose, bro. He <laughs> looks like a damn monkey. Yo. I'm going to use that one. I want to be dark as hell, boy. What's the hairstyle look like? <laughs> oh, see, this racist. They knew niggas was playing this game. They they do what they do. Oh no, hell no, no. They got dreads. Nah, I'm not doing dreads. They got the NBA young boy shit. This game. <laughs> Funny already, man. <laughs> Which one y'all like? Oh my god. I like this one. I like this one. This kind of fire. I like that game. I don't care too much about eyebrows. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. I am indeed a student, but I could very well be able to help you. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. A few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. That was quite something. Now with the deep ass voice. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. All right, we're gonna be a witch or a wizard. All right, let's go. We're gonna be a wizard. I'm about to make your body spider. Ah, it appears we are almost ready to depart. It's a pity we didn't have a bit more time to spend on spell casting. I presume you've been practicing the spells we worked on. I have, Professor. Well. I'm quite sure I've never seen anyone take so quickly to a second-hand mm -hmm. wand. You'll be a force to be reckoned with when you get your own. Thank you, Professor Fig. I appreciate you working with me all the time. Oh, <laughs> Eleazar! 
George, glad my rather cryptic description of our location did not thwart your finding us. I've apparated to more vaguely defined destinations than this. <laughs> Though I confess I may have miscalculated slightly on my first try. <laughs> Gave quite the fright to some theater goers in the West End. <laughs> I got the drip, boy. Hold on. When I received your owl, I must uh, say I... Best not speak Hold on, I'm gonna show the chat. Hold on. Is, uh, of course. Why don't we speak en route to Hogwarts? We have a start of term feast and a sorting ceremony to get to. Wonderful idea. As long as your young charge here doesn't mind me tagging along. Not at all, sir. After you. Ages since I've been to the castle. Would be good to see the old pile of rocks. traveling companion a new student new yes sir i'm like starting Christmas school as a fifth year <laughs> how extraordinary it, it is indeed none of the faculty has ever heard of anyone being admitted to hogwarts so late nor have i of course as the other fifth years will have been honing their magical skills for four years now the headmaster asked if i could get our new student up to speed a bit before the term begins well you couldn't have asked for a better mentor. Professor Fig is not only an exceptional teacher, he's also a remarkably intuitive and gifted wizard. Mr. Osric is prone to flattery. I dare say it's one of the reasons he's risen so far at the Ministry. <laughs> have you seen this? Yes. I have. Opinions differ as to how great a threat Ranrock really is. Although I've yet to convince my colleagues at the Ministry, I believe he is a significant threat. And it was your wife, Eleazar, who alerted me to his activities months ago. Miriam? How? <sighs> she wrote to me about Ranrock before she died wondering what the Ministry knew about his activities. Before I could respond, I received this. It was the last thing she sent me, Eleazar. It came to me via her owl, but with no correspondence. I can only assume that she had to get rid of it quickly to keep it safe. Presumably from Ranrock. I cannot open it. Whatever magic protects this is powerful indeed. It looks like goblin metal. That symbol. What's that glow? I don't see a glow. Nor do I. Merlin's beard. How did you... Wait! We did... Oh my god. There's no That's just so random. Did y'all see how the dragon tore that? <laughs> oh, 
Oh, that's funny. Are you all right? You're hurt. Perhaps a bit. Take this. It's Wigan World Potion. That stuff will write you in a second. What happened? Poor George. I can't believe he... What the hell got into that damn thing? Attacking a carriage mid-air? A typical dragon would never... Professor? <sighs> Sir, where are we? I'm not sure. But that key you discovered was clearly a port key. Port key? An item enchanted to bring whoever touches it to a specific place. I'm feeling better, sir, if you'd like to look around a bit. I would, but stay close. We've no idea who created this port key, or why. All right. This has not been the day either of us expected. But Miriam sent that port key to George for a reason. And I believe that she, and now George, died in pursuit of whatever it was meant to lead to. If you're sure you're all right and wouldn't mind indulging me, I'd like to have a look around. Absolutely, sir. Good. Let's see if we can find a path, however faded it may be. And I should download it for o'clock. Damn. Mind your step. Where do you suppose your wife got the pool key that brought us here? A good question. Miriam spent years searching for evidence of a long forgotten form of ancient magic. Ancient magic? Yes. A powerful magic wielded by a rare few that seems to have been lost to time. Hogwarts Castle was built by, and is itself a stronghold of that ancient magic. I don't know where she came into possession of the port key, but I am certain it was to do with that search. Ah, yeah, there's the part down below. I have this no way. idea. You gotta ask I ain't never been up. It's right, dude. But, sir, why was your wife searching for evidence of lost magic? Miriam wanted to understand why such powerful magic disappeared from the wizarding world. Spoke of the good it could do. But magic is no different than any power. What really matters is the one who wields it. Is that ice? It's not cold enough here. It appears to be a sort of enchantment. Someone wanted to block this path. Let's see some of that wand work you were practicing. Focus on the center. Excellent! That is a bit rougher than I'd expected. Your wand work's improving with every cast. Thank you, sir. Ah, up there. Is this guy in a regular We're stuff or what? Now. It's just ahead. Steady yourself! Repero! Almost! 
almost there. Why would someone have built this here? I suspect they valued their privacy. That port key led us here for a reason. Let's have a look around for anything that seems out of place. This intro to this shit boring, man. Where the titties at? Okay. The women shaking ass, man. That's how I want to see. That enchanted crystallized stone again. But what could it be blocking? What's this? Professor Fig! How odd. Why would someone have conjured that enchanted stone here? And how is there a room behind it? What room? I don't see anything. There's that glow again, like the glow on the port key container. What in Merlin's name? Godric's heart. Where are we? I don't believe it. Snoring, snoring. Nigga, who is snoring? Oh, this nigga. Hello. What the fuck is this? Who is that? A it can't be. Oh! Uh, just a moment. <laughs> <Ooh. clears throat> Where are we here? <clears throat> Welcome to Gringotts Wizarding Bank. Vault number 12, I presume. <laughs> Precisely. The key? Hmm? Your wife's port key. Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> this way, then. Stay close. After you, I'd kick his midget ass on my carriage. Uh, keep your hands inside the cart if you don't wish to lose them. <laughs> Are there any great gods? Hundreds. In fact, you'll see quite a few on our way to vault number 12. As we speak, we're just beneath the main lobby. The vaults you see now are the newest. Are private entrances to the bank common at Green Gods? They are most uncommon. Only one with great wealth or power, or both, could have arranged for such a service. You'll want to take a breath. A what? That waterfall washes away all enchantments. It's a security measure. Experienced the thief's downfall before, have you? Heard of it? These are the lower vaults that we're passing now. How deep are we going? Vault number 12 was commissioned shortly after Gringotts was founded over four centuries ago. It resides in the deepest part of the bank. Settle it. We've quite a distance to go.
sort of these midgets, bro. Vote number. Vote 12. Momentous day. <laughs> hmm. On your way. This shit make me want to watch Harry Potter. Not me. It makes me want to throw up. Professor. Looks fun. The old band that God was wearing was glowing. Like the glow you saw on the porky container. No, darker. I saw that same glow on the dragon's collar. Yeah, what was that? We were just wondering about that goblin back there. He watches over the oldest section of the bank. Rare anyone goes there anymore. Was accessed. A goblin has been stationed at my desk for hundreds of years. In that time, no one has visited Vault 12 until today. Vault 12, thank you for your help. I'd have kicked his midget ass. What do you suppose we should be looking for? I'm not sure. Sir, I wonder if you might... The instructions for Vault 12 indicate that I am to grant access to the holder of the key and then close the door. Wait. Best of luck. <sighs> Professor, that was certainly unexpected. Let me think. There must be something here. Hmm, Revelio, perhaps. Revelio? Yes, a revealing charm. No time like the present. Let's see what we're missing, shall we? Ready your wand and focus. What? Closer and try again. Okay. A door. Well, that's a start. There's that symbol again. I don't suppose you see a way to. I do, Professor. That symbol has the same glow as the one I saw on the port key container. If what you can see reveals the way forward, then I dare say we are about to discover the secret of this vault. Lead the way. Lumos! This is no ordinary vault. I suspect we will need to earn our way out of here. What do you mean, earn our way out? Do you think this is some sort of test? I do. But to what end, I can't say. Stay close. There will be no disapparating if things go poorly. Not out of Gringotts. This shit is weird. Ain't in, in here, right? I see something up ahead. What is it? That glow again, but on the floor. Lumos! What happened? When I moved towards the glow, it suddenly seemed as if the ground was swirling about. Are you all right? Yes, sir. I'm fine. You seem to have caused the floor to change. That statue? What statue? 
I see some sort of statue, but only as a reflection in the floor. There must be something to that reflection you're seeing. Revelio, I presume this is what you saw reflected in the floor. It is. The reflection's still there, but the statue's positions don't match. Wait, when you moved, the reflection turned in the direction of the light. Hmm, perhaps you should cast Lumos. All right, let's go. Here we go, Lumos. Okay. Lumos. Well done. Now the reflection is turning towards me. It does follow the light. Professor Fig! L Professor, where are you? This isn't good. Where am I supposed to go? What's happening? Where is he at? The wisps of magic seem to be leading me somewhere. Ah, that's where they're leading me. Come on. Rebellion. I suppose I'm on my own this time. Okay. Was this a chest? All right. Lumos. Rebellion. Rebellion. I need to align these statues with their reflections. So, how am I supposed to do that? Lumos. Revelio. Are you? Lumos. Yeah, how do I rotate them? That's the thing, how do you rotate these? Perhaps I need to get them all to stand at once. Ah. Gotcha. 
Wait, isn't it the Rebellion? Okay, yeah, he says Shrekka. Lumos. It seems I have no choice. I'm going to have to fight my way out of here. Got it. Oh my god, he moves pretty quick. You're good. Yeah, I need that. Oh, triangle to learn. Okay. What a dot there. I thought I did that. Oh, get it wrong. Hold on. Stupid fun. Okay. Stupid fun. Stupid fun. Stupid fun. Oh, I missed that. That would uh Is that a limit? Hang on, I'm a bad Oh, where did you come from, buddy? Lumos. They got me stuck in this dungeon. I don't know, but I found this floating above that basin. That is no mere basin. That is a pensive for viewing memories. I wonder. Place. The port key is well hidden. Perhaps too well. I wonder if the path we've created may be impossible to follow. It will only be impossible for one who cannot see traces of ancient magic as I can. Your ability to see what others cannot will not be enough, Percival. We are entrusting the one who embarks on this path with powerful secrets, with knowledge others will do anything to obtain. Yes. And if we are correct, Charles, the witch or wizard who completes the trials will have proven themselves worthy of that knowledge and the responsibility that accompanies it. We've done all that we can. So at this part of the 
the real Harry Potter storyline or something? Or this is just a... The glow that surrounded them. Yes, sir. Astonishing. Can I see magic? Traces of an ancient magic, to be precise. You know who this old fart? The magic that Miriam had always believed existed. Nah, this is a thousand years before. But could never... Miriam, and perhaps George, died in pursuit of knowledge that has been dormant for centuries. And you, it seems, are the key to understanding why. We were... It all looks rather different than it did a moment ago. <laughs> Someone's coming. Who were they? I don't know. But, sir, you shouldn't be in here. Uh. I was right. Ranrock. Seems my reputation precedes me. I was beginning to think no one was ever going to visit Rackham's Vault. And why are you here? No need for that. Just give me whatever it is you found here and we can let bygones be bygones. Uh, sir, they have the key to the vault. <laughs> Choose your next words wisely. I... I only meant that the instructions to Vault 12 were quite clear. Sir, I, I must insist. I was to grant access only to one with the key, and you didn't have the I have no patience for traitors. Now, where were we? I'm not giving you anything. Hmm. Well, perhaps your young friend here will be more helpful. Are you all right? Fine, sir. I've never seen so powerful a goblin. He seemed wholly unaffected by my magic. Where are we? <laughs> it can't be. It seems those who set up the pensive, the locket, and the path to both wanted someone with your ability to end up here. Come. We have a sorting ceremony to get to. Bro, this shit, man, get to the good part, man. Get to the good part, man. I've been walking around, talking to midgets. Bro, I want to kill something, man. Come on, give him some adventures. Give some missions or something, man. I'm taking me with this old car. Now we gotta go on the Polo Express and shit. I mean, I don't, you know, I don't have a patience. Bro. I want to, I want, I want to see some. I want to see them knock my socks off, man. Yeah. We enjoying this? What about you, J Sports? Please wait for game installation to complete. <laughs> 